the last few years, the design of Dyson's Digital Slim Cordless Vacuum hasn't changed much on the outside, but with each new generation, the company makes its high-end portable vacs more powerful while improving the battery life. In the case of Dyson's latest and greatest model, the Digital Slim DC59 Animal, the company is billing it as a conventional vacuum replacement, saying it offers three times more suction power than any other cordless vacuum on the market. Battery life has also improved from about 20 minutes to 26 minutes. That time drops to six minutes if you engage the max power button, which gives you an extra boost for those tougher cleaning jobs. The technology driving the suction number and the vacuum itself is a new V6 motor that Dyson says is one and a half times as powerful as the previous motor. Like other digital slim models, the DC59 comes with an assortment of attachments, including a detachable long reach wand and motorized head with carbon filaments for cleaning hard floors. A step down model, the DC58, which costs half the price, leaves off the wand and motorized head. Dyson refers to the DC58 as a handheld model because it's not designed to take the place of a conventional upright vacuum and really is just a hand vac. Both the DC58 and DC59 come with a combination tool that has a nozzle that converts into a brush tool for dusting. They also come with a wall mounting accessory that allows you to create a docking station for the vac. Of course, you want to put that docking station near a power outlet so you could easily recharge the unit when not in use. While our appliances team in Louisville will put this vac through its rigorous testing regime and conducting our full review, I've been playing around with it a bit and I have to say I'm pretty impressed. I haven't used a more powerful hand vac and it definitely feels like it has more suction than the previous model, the DC44. I did notice that it seems to run slightly warmer, or at least the air being expelled during operation seems a bit warmer and doesn't seem to be any quieter. For smaller apartments and other small spaces, I do think the DC59 can take the place of a conventional vacuum. It does have a couple of small drawbacks, however. While the vac is equipped with a new one-touch bin emptying system, which makes it easy to get rid of the detritus you collect, the bin is pretty small and fills up quickly when cleaning dirtier environments. The other more glaring drawback is the price. Previous models listed for $399.99, but you'll have to pay an extra $100 or $499.99 to take this home with you. Hopefully that price will come down over time because $500 is an awful lot to spend for a cordless vac, even the ultimate one. But if you can do without the extra floor cleaning tools, the less expensive DC58 is the way to go. It's also pricey at $250 but 250 sounds a whole lot less than 500. I'm David Carnoy, thanks for watching.